So, wine cap culture I had a few months ago. The latest fruiting. Wine caps, King Stefaria. Heirloom tomatoes. Some of my favorite things. Isn't that pretty? Some big ones down there. One of them is Cherokee and the other one's some other heirloom. Got some berries growing. It's not growing as good this time. We got some strawberries. But yeah, the King Stefaria. This is from Fungi Perfecti, one of their cultures. I had it fruit and flower and then I broke it up and put it out here and now it's growing. Here goes gills. Pretty neat little close up. Pretty freaking cool. Zoom in pretty far nowadays. You know, I also grow oysters right here. You see the bulbous on this one? It's pretty cool. So, yeah, just a little update. Got it from Fungi Perfect Dye. I just added some more cultures from somebody else. Some blue oysters, so I'll let you know if that comes through and grows. But yeah, check it out. I'm starting to crack from growing. This might even be an oyster. But from the bulbous at the bottom, I say it's a wine cap. Because oysters do not have a stipe like that. That's, that's just from it opening. I'm not going to eat it or anything. I just like it to break down coffee grounds and stuff into you know, soil. So that's where the ribs connected. It's pretty neat. It is about July 12th, 2018. I started this way back when it was snowing where I lived. Maybe about February and then put it outside by like May and it froze and still getting plenty of mushrooms growing in. Yeah, just so you guys got to see it. Going with my strawberries.